the most accurate weather forecast in South Texas with Chief Meteorologist Dale Nelson. Hi everybody, welcome back. Well, a few stray showers around today. You can see them working up from the south and off to the north. It's probably most likely rain free down to the south, with the exception of a little drizzle or mist here and there. But there are some showers here south of Refurio over to the north of Rockport, working northward up towards Sea Drift. So we do have some light rain in the area, but again, working away from the city. What's the big change from yesterday to today? Yesterday we had high pressure on top of us in the upper atmosphere. That brought the sinking air and those sunny skies for much of the region. That high moved out and was replaced by low pressure today. So we had rising air, which once it rises to certain levels in the atmosphere, it condenses and makes for rain. Now the low is not very strong and it's far removed from us. So again, we're just seeing a little bit of rain, but again, a big difference from yesterday and that's what it was. Here's the satellite and the radar and you can see most of the cloud cover working off to the north and east. Drier air coming in from Mexico and that's going to be with us tomorrow. So guess what? When the sun comes out tomorrow, it is really going to warm up and be well into the 80s and certainly feel like spring. So there's the area of low pressure that's going to move off to the north and east and again bring us a better weather here tomorrow. Evening forecast calls for temperatures in the 70s, maybe a sprinkle or two, low 70s by midnight. And uh, then we'll hold there till about 3 a.m. and then drop briefly into the upper 60s towards daybreak. Our low temperatures look like this across the region, 70 near the coast to the mid 60s inland, so fairly uniform with the cloud deck tonight and the persistent southeasterly winds. But it all changes tomorrow, not so much in the morning where it'll still be mild and muggy, a little bit breezy at 12 miles an hour, but notice the winds actually be lower at noon at about 10 miles an hour. That's light and it'll be humid. The sun will start to break out in those conditions and 79 degrees. Then the sun comes out tomorrow afternoon and by 5 p.m. it'll be warm and 85. So tomorrow definitely different from today as the sun emerges in the afternoon hours. Now here's the uh, future tracker on the clouds and rain and you can see a little bit of rain in the area. Again, very, very light overnight and tomorrow morning along the coast near Rockport and Port Aransas. Tomorrow afternoon the clouds start to break up around noon and then we get into the afternoon hours and here comes the sunshine with that drier air moving in from the west. So that's the significant part of this. And uh, then we have this area of low pressure that's going to drop in. That upper level disturbance will uh, bring a little bit of rain this weekend, but not much with the trailing cold front Sunday night. The winds look like this out ahead of it. And again, the winds are going to lay uh, here overnight and during the day tomorrow and on into Friday morning, but they ramp up in response to that system then Friday afternoon. Here is your NEC Co-op Energy 7-day forecast. 68 tonight, 86 tomorrow with the afternoon sun, 85 more clouds Friday, then windy with isolated thunder showers on Saturday, but only isolated. And uh, then we'll see a few showers Sunday night with that front and 87, and then nice after that.